Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, this week, honestly, there's a lot of things happening in the world of Disney. Um, so yesterday, Magic Kingdom and Animal Kingdom both fully reopened. It's still reduced capacity, wearing face masks, everything like that. That is still all happening, um, but it is officially reopened. So that is very exciting. I'm still very hesitant when it comes to going back to the parks and everything like that. Um, so with that, I just kind of thought it would be fun to go walk around Disney Springs, um, see what's happening there because I haven't been in about a week, I would say. So we're going to go walk around. We're going to see what is happening because World of Disney is always fun to go to and Disney style. Also, I don't know which mask to wear. I'm thinking this one will match like the yellow on yellow, but also I have my Jumbo mask that I kind of want to wear. I don't know, but yeah, we're just going to go walk around. There's really not much we're going to do today. We're just going to see what's happening, see if there's anything new. So yeah, let's go. First stop, as always, Disney style. Hi. This and both of these, I want. Those are so cute. All right, we're on to our second stop, which if you already could not tell what it is, it's going to be the world famous world of Disney. So, we're going to head that way. Now I will say, these safety measures that Disney has in place right now are going to be in place for a very, very long time. This will not change for a very long time. And if you also could not tell, I had to change my mask. <laughs> I had never tried on the two that I had before and they are way too small so I had to change but it's fine I will say one thing to know about Disney masks is when you wash them they will shrink so I have washed mine and this hurts behind my ears and we are in they have it now where it's practically a walk-in. You don't need a reservation to get in, which is nice. Um, but you can also tell that it is popping in here. So, be wary if you decide to come in. It is quite busy. Okay, so I have really gotten into lounge fly backpacks lately. Um, and this one right here is hands down my favorite. To be honest, um, it's not that great in here. Um, I might end up leaving because people are not really social distancing. Um, and it just kind of seems like people aren't really doing their part. This hasn't happened before, but Today is not that great, so I think I'm gonna leave Disney Springs. Um, at least World of Disney right now. I might leave Springs though. Because even outside of World of Disney, um, it still hasn't been that great. So it looks like they have a DJ of some sort out here at the main stage. Um, I'm looking around. Benches, puppy markers on them. We are home. I'm telling you. <laughs> All I gotta say, I, I, after this, I gotta go become a BBC member because I gotta officially say I'm home. That's what it is, you know. Part of the old one. 
same process. I love it all though. I love this. So it seems like a lot more stuff is open and running today. Because obviously Magic Kingdom and Animal Kingdom are now open. Um, okay, the music is a lot louder. So there's clearly a lot more people. Um, everyone wants to be here because they can't be in the parks, most likely. Um, but to be honest, I know this is not Disney's fault right now, but when you are in more congested areas, it's not as safe. I want to say though, there are definitely people here that are social distancing. They are making sure that they are staying safe as well as keeping others safe, which is nice. But like I said, when you are in those more congested areas and there's just a lot of people, it just does not seem like anyone is doing anything to stay distant or really anything to stay away from others, which is kind of sad. Now, to be honest, the entire reason, the entire reason I came to Springs was because I wanted to see what it was going to be like opening day and mostly because I knew I wasn't going to be in the parks. Um, so there's a lot of stuff that is obviously going to change because, you know, more people are going to are going to want to be in the parks and, you know, if they can't, then that just kind of frustrates and upsets people. So they then take it out on others um, at a different location. So I just, uh, Springs is not great today. Um, I came here with the sole purpose and intent to walk around and see what was happening and what the parks were like. And to be honest, this is not what I was expecting. Um, it's just too much. And I honestly just don't want to stay here. I can't handle it. Um, it's not that I don't feel safe. It's just that I don't feel comfortable here. So, to be honest, I know this is going to be a very, very, very short vlog, but I just can't, I can't stay here with the way that things are today. Hey guys, so I do want to say one last thing before I end this vlog. Um, I came to Springs at around five o'clock and it is now almost 5.30 um, and I am already leaving to go home. I did not want to stay because I did not feel particularly safe as much as I had been when I went to the parks. Um, maybe that's just from today and it's for people who weren't able to be in the parks, but still it's no excuse to not stay safe. Um, so I am going to go back home. I know it was a very short vlog. I wanted to see what things would be like outside of the parks on property. Um, clearly it was not the best. So yeah, I am going to end this vlog here. Um, hopefully things will change at Springs. Um, so everyone can feel extremely safe. I didn't have any issues when I was in the parks. Um, there were a couple here and there, but they were immediately fixed. Um, Springs is a very different story. So I'm just going to end it here and hopefully things will change. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.